place to eat, drink, play, and watch sports. A chance, chance run counter, six foot two, Justin Patterson, five foot ten. We fight like the taller fighter. With the official introductions, Michael C. Williams. Bellator MMA presented by Miller Lite tonight from Wingstar World Casino and Resort. Now goes to the welterweight division set for three five minute rounds. Introducing the blue corner at six foot two, weighing in 170.1 pounds. His professional record 10 wins, just two losses from Pawhuska, Oklahoma. He fights out of Barrio Logan, California. Chance Black Eagle. Red counter. And across the cage, fighting out of the red corner at five foot ten, weighing in 170 pounds, even his professional record. Nine wins with three losses by way of Haltham City. He fights out of Fort Worth, Texas. Introducing Justin the Tactician Patterson. And the referee in charge of the action, Kerry Hatley. So, Kerry Hatley, our referee for this welterweight matchup between two experienced fighters. Chance Rencontre, Black Eagle, 13th right, professional man, fight. Ready? Ready? Same Good work. for the tactician in the red gloves, Justin Patterson. Our fight box brought to you by Miller Lite, the original light beer. Cheers. It's Miller time. This is right at that point in their career, 12 pro fights, where it's, am I going to make a career out of this? Am I going to get to that next level or not? This is a lot of times that number of fights will start making those decisions. Southpaw versus Southpaw. Red gloves for Patterson, blue for Chance to Contra. with some of the guys at Alliance MMA. Patterson, all powers fitness and fighting and the Junkyard Dogs fight team. That seems like a team that you would be a member of. I like it, I like it already. <laughs> Bring it back to 1980s for me right there. There you go, see that's when White Man Can't Jump came out. I like how both these guys are moving. I'll tell you that yeah. right out of the gate. I mean, we're getting mixed up here. Both these guys are coming over the Look at that, see we're, we're throwing punches in numbers here. Not just one and two fights. As the card escalates, as the talent escalates, and yes, the later you are on the card, the better fighter you are. We're starting to see more skills. Not just a jab, a jab followed by a cross. A cross followed by a hook. A hook followed by a leg kick. It's when it starts to flow, where you're able to put things together and mix up the different disciplines, be it your takedowns, your hands, your Muay Thai, your Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. That's when you become very dangerous and effective. I love seeing what more experienced fighters do in the opening round. Chance putting money in the bank with the leg kick so far, and it's Patterson looking more like the headhunter, working the body a little bit, but focusing more on the chin. Third Bellator fight for Chance Recontra and Justin Patterson, three and two inside the Bellator cage. Chance, real speed on that jab. Something you don't see Southpaws use that often, but facing another Southpaw, it works well. Four inches taller and the reach advantage for Black Eagle. And he's trying to utilize it here early. No free shots here for Rencontre. Every time he steps in, a lot of times he's getting the better of the exchanges, but Patterson is hitting it back and making it pay. Patterson's gonna do the scoop right here. Doing a good job keeping at least half guard with that right leg extended all the way. Trying to hold on to that thigh. If he could kick that left leg down, Jimmy, break yep. through that arm. And get a little of a better lock here, could change that position. But right now he's in a good, Chance is in a good passing position. Chance has not finished a professional fight by submission yet. Six by knockout, four by decision. He's going in Dar's position, trying to sink his hips down. He might have oh, I, it. I think he does have this. He's very deep. Looking to finish it right here, right now. Goalie, it's all a question of how much is Rencontra on his own bicep. And it's all over. Chance Rencontra with the submission win, first of his professional career. The next fighter is going to want Goldie to say, I haven't <laughs> won with a blank. Whatever that is, he's going to win. That's going to be the Goldie Jinx.
Why that, is it going to be lining up for it? And that's why when you're a play-by-play -play announcer in the NHL, you never say shut out. Bam. Boom. <laughs> Let's see the finish on our black card. Premium spice rum replay. The bold 93 proof rum that's edgy to the core. And one of the reasons I think he didn't want to pass guard is he was thinking Darce from the outside. We talked about how he could pass quite easily over this leg. What does he choose to do? Go inside with the right arm and look.